Hi. How you doing? Hi, everybody. What's going on? We're here coming at you again. Family, shh. She want me to participate in this. <laughs> and uh, I don't want to participate today. Because the topic too real. You know, most of y'all might be mad at us after we do this one. Yeah. We got to bring it the real to you sometimes. Every once in a while, it's like Tina Turner say, we always do it nice and easy. Yeah. <laughs> so we got we to gotta shake it up a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but for real, I'm excited about this topic. You know, uh, it's about why Africans hate African Americans. Uh, is it recording? So today, we want to talk to you all about why Africans hate African Americans or Black Americans. Whichever one you like, right. I say African American, you say Black American, tomato, apple. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know, uh, mm -hmm. So before we start though, you know, I want to... Keep it 1,000 with y'all. Um, y'all can write whatever y'all want to write. So this is a real topic. So we're not going to act like it's not a real topic or a real situation since we've been here. Of course, we've been talking with multiple people, a lot of people. And uh, we are in Africa. So you, we're, we're going to be speaking from experience from us being here. So, And this is our point of view. And how we feel. So if y'all feel a certain way because we do it, y'all can write it in the comments and I'm going to delete it. <laughs> <laughs> now nah, y'all can write whatever y'all want. Right. You know what I'm saying? But mm -hmm. this is real. So, and I don't want to have to say that uh, because you know one African or I know one African that that one African don't feel like this. No, we talking about overall, all right? So I don't want to have to go over that. Right. So let me get that out right, right. now. Right. So, what's one of the reasons you think? Uh, TV. Yeah. Media. TV. Yeah. TV. And we know who control TV, media. We know who created TV, media. We know what they created it for. Mm -hmm. And so it's, it's always used against us. When we talk to most of the Africans, uh, what they say? Yeah, man. So, how is Trump? He's an. How's Bush? He's an. How's Obama? He's great. Right. So the TV, you know, y'all, y'all too into the TV. Yeah, cause it's just basically telling you what you're supposed to think, and yeah. that's what. They want y'all to think that, you know. Yeah. So. You know, y'all see us. Y'all already have this. This. What is it? Preconceived? Yeah, notion of us. Mm -hmm. Because TV shows, what? They watch the movies and the TV shows. Yeah. We all, and it's like, what's up, my Right. They'll come up to you and say that, you know. What's up? What? What's up? You know, and like, no. And boy. Yeah, oh. Um, what? Oh, my God. I look like a boy to you? Oh, my God. Boy? Like. Um, what you think, China? Oh, uh, yeah, we got to let y'all China back in the studio with us again. Hey, my DP. Yeah. You know, my <laughs> DP. Okay. Okay, yeah. Okay. She's, that's what she's here for. Mm. So, um, we have a takeover mentality. Yeah, so, and we do, we have a lot of us who come over. We, we be wanting to tell y'all, like about y'all culture and how y'all should be and yeah. how to light a fire and, right you know what i'm saying like how to use your building materials right, right all that type of stuff we do and i know you know when i talk to a couple of my peoples big ben and everybody else you know that it irritates them you know what i'm saying so it's like you gotta fall back yeah 
you know, I have to realize, oh, you know, they've been here, they've been doing right. this. Right. And so, I mean, it's something they hate because we come over here and we think we know everything. Right. And they want us to come over here and learn their culture first and mm -hmm. understand where they're coming from and things like that. And we sit. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. I don't know if they want us to come and learn their culture. I ain't going to even lie. Most of the time, once you start talking about what they doing wrong, then it's when they want you to learn right, the culture. Right, right. But yeah. when you first come, they like, man, hey, so how you do this? Yeah. Y'all in America do like this. They be watching the way we walk, mm -hmm. watching the way we talk. How we, so, y'all you know I mean? <laughs> y'all you <know I> mean? <laughs> Don't they? <laughs> you know, so they want to do So then, you know, we get the big head. We like, we need to tell y'all how to do everything yeah, then. Yeah. You know, which, of course, is not right. It's not. It's not. Okay, next. Yeah. Monica, keep up, man. Come on. So. Keep up, girl. So, um, we believe we're owed something here in Africa. Yeah. Most people, if you talk to a... African American who believe they're an African American and that the family had been taken in slavery, all of that. We like when we come, we like, man, where are our at? Reparations. <laughs> Reparations will be in America. I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm just saying that that's the mindset. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> No, it is. It's the mindset. <laughs> yeah, we believe that when we come over here, it's like, where's the land that, that's ours? Like, for free. Yeah. Yeah, because you know my family was taken, but I don't know where it's from. Mm -hmm. You know, so a lot of them hate that. They like, mm -hmm. bro, you a foreigner. Yeah, yeah. Like, we supposed to just come in, get our land, get our bank accounts, bill, boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Everything is... The, the, the red carpet should be laid yeah. out. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and they don't like that. No. So, come on, let's go. Yeah, come so on. um it's us versus the world. Oh yeah. Now, if you're from a different country and you know an African American, yeah, you know that we don't think nobody us. No. <laughs> we don't. We it's like Yeah. Some of us come over here humble, but ninety nine point nine one 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 nine, nine nine. Nah, yeah. We don't. What struggles? Y'all talk about struggles, huh? What violence? Y'all talk about violence? Y'all don't know. Y'all don't know none of this. We treat them like they know nothing. Yeah, that's kind of going back to like we feel like we have to teach, teach them. them. You know, because it's a lot of stuff that they don't understand. Just like it's a lot of stuff that we don't understand when we come over. But we act like, because, you know, we know it all. We we African-Americans, man. We are know it all. We know it all. It's like, we know everything, for real. When they, even when we wrong, we like, we right, bro. Right. And if we don't know it, we can learn it quicker than. Yeah, because we know it all. What you think? Yeah. Yeah. It's true. Yeah. A lot of us believe that. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, most of us ain't coming over here humble. Like, I know some people right now. Right now. I've had conversations. And they were, they like, look, I ain't come over here to be friends and cool and right. all that. No. We coming to take over. They don't know what they doing with they stuff. Right. If you get offended by that, then it's probably you. So. <laughs> yep. You the one saying it. And we know it. Right. Anyways, uh, we treat them like they're from the bush. Yeah, because also TV. Yeah, and we, that's we we saw TV. Right, we watch TV too. Right, you know, and most of us believe the bugs flying around, the kid yeah, mouth, the mouth and the eye, and they and and swatting it away. You know, and, you know, and yeah. where they at? They by a hut. We still believe they in, in a huts. Hut. You know what I'm saying? And baby, when I tell you, they got. Houses and and they dress to the T. We ain't even supposed to talk about that either. <laughs> that's that's for the episode of what we like 
about them. But we can still repeat No, don't tell them nothing. <laughs> That's a whole nother show. You messing with money now. Yeah. Now I'm just playing. Go ahead. Next, we get treated better than the natives. Now, why did I put that one? That we get treated better than the natives. Is yes. When yeah, when we come... We get treated better than the people who are here. And y'all know the natives. I don't know if y'all know this, but if you do a drop of research, we in Gambia, and uh, the people who are the, the, the natives here are Jolas. So we get treated better than them, but we get treated better than basically any of the Africans that's here. You know what I'm saying? And it's because of the people. Yeah. It's because yeah. of the Africans yeah. that we get treated like that. And tourism. Yeah, and money that they think that we have. We have. Oh my God! Yeah. yeah, they think we coming over here balling. Out of control, and so <laughs> their mind is the frame of mind, mm -hmm. the thought of us. It's out of control. Yeah, most of us don't have. I just want y'all to know. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't know that. It's true, but we get treated better than we don't get treated better than the white folk. Right. But, yeah. And speaking of white folks, uh, most Americans can't stand... African Americans. Can't stand white folks. Now, being honest, the Gambians treat the white folk like gods. Y'all know. Yes. And I'm talking about even when we talk to them, when we talk to them, they like, yeah, these people are this, this, this. Right. They can't but, do no wrong. No, 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 no. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying if I'm having a conversation with them, they like, yeah, they are, they, these people are like this. We see it on TV. Mm -hmm. We, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We heard the stories. Yeah. Kuta Kente, all this. And then what you see? Huh? Yeah. Almost getting carried around. Like they almost getting carried yeah. around. Cause I'm saying like how they let how they let them talk to them and you know. Yeah, yeah. And like I said, I don't want to have to explain to y'all that one person don't hate one person. Right. We all got friends. Exactly. I just want y'all to know. I'm <laughs> talking about overall. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, they hate that we don't love them like they do. Like they do. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's continue. Mm -hmm. So they believe they're better than us. Now, I want y'all to ask somebody who worked with an African in America. I want y'all to ask somebody. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Because a lot of people I know I'm going off what I know. Mm -hmm. They say they, like the Africans, act like they better than us. Oh my God. You know? So over here, when I'm talking to some African Americans here, they feel the same way over here. Now me, I haven't had it where, you know, I've talked to somebody and I felt like they felt like they was better. I haven't had that. And I think that it just goes back to, um, you know, as far as culture, one culture, you know, they, and the way that they see us, you know, it's like they're more, you know, they feel like they're more educated and more uh, refined. They have better values. Right. You know, you different know. stuff like that. So, and because of what they hear on TV, TV we just, you know. like, we are the animals. Just like when we see them on TV, we like, man. Right. They living like animals. Right. You know, so when they see us, they like, we just violent, aggressive, Loud, talking, you know, all of that. Mm -hmm. So they feel like that. So when they come, they like, we gonna get in line with, you know, the people who control in the country. Right. You know? Why can't, why can't they just do what they're told or what, you know, everybody else is doing? Yeah. <laughs> Next, um... Speaking of black Americans are impatient. We are. Yeah. Done. 
Yeah. I believe that we are impatient. Yeah. Next. Yeah, so they hate us because we're impatient. Yeah. And we coming over here trying to push them. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. they like to move. They like, but what we hear about you guys in America, y'all not getting it done. <laughs> and y'all want to come over here to Africa, to our country, country. Mm-hmm. and tell us how to get it done? Uh, yeah. Tell what? Us what? Yeah. Pushy. Pushy Americans. Yeah. <laughs> <That's> just... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Suck they teeth. Pushy. I don't know how to do that, but yeah. <laughs> I barely did it. <laughs> mm-hmm. I ain't there yet. So. But okay. Um, they believe everything is easy for us and money grows on trees. TV, man. The money, like, now I know some people be playing, but I know some people they actually aren't playing. Believe. They believe the money grow on trees. Like for real. They like what we've hit what we hear is that the money actually grow on trees. And we we like we don't even get to see fruit grow on trees. <laughs> what? Some money growing on trees. You know how pole <laughs> niggas are over there? Like Man, yes, they like it's no homeless. You know how many it's, bills? Oh my god. They like they can come over there. You know and, niggas don't own nothing? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yes. But yeah, they like they can come over there, work one day, Man. be able to make enough money to buy them a house Man. and <laughs> everything in life. It's like, all false. false. Yes. False. So they be hating us when we tell them like, yeah. no, that's not how it is. Cause Break you know, down that dream. Once people once people have a belief, oh my god. The facts don't matter. No. The no, facts don't matter. And ain't nobody over here. I'm sorry. Talking overall, once again, but ain't nobody over here looking up no statistics. No. How poor, and I mean poor, Negroes are, and blacks and African Americans. They ain't looking at how, like they ain't looking at none of that. But niggas is poor. Money do not grow on trees. We don't even walk down the street and see fruit. <laughs> we don't see cows. We don't see chickens. We don't see none of that. You go to the hood. You see graffiti. You see houses messed up. You see, I mean, just whatever. Dry grass. <laughs> yeah, the grass ain't green. <laughs> Y'all think it's green on the other side, but this, look. No. All right. I mean, America does, it is beautiful. When you compare it to, you know, when the countries are trying to build, yeah, it's beautiful. But yeah, ain't nobody getting money like that, bro. It's a system, and you are locked in the system, exactly. period. Exactly. And it's like me, I don't try to convince nobody like not to want to go. Yeah. No, that's on you. I'm going to tell you, you, where are you from? What you, this is this, this is that. Exactly. Believe what you want to believe. Up to you to decide. Mm-hmm. They don't understand really why we leave America. Yeah. After everybody watched the, 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 the a beat down of somebody, a black person or African-American, they watch the beat down of them. They watch them get shot. They watch all of these different things. And then they be like, I can't wait to go. I can't wait to go to America. Mm-hmm. Hey, give me to America. Can you help me get to America? You know, and two, because they don't, they're not getting taught about like slavery. They not, they not taught about that for real. When you talk to a lot of them, they like, yeah, I learned that from talking to somebody else. I didn't learn it from in school because, you know, whatever the, whoever colonized the country, that's kind of the education system that's being taught. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. most of us are coming because, you know, when you're tired of shit, you're just tired. Yeah. When you see the way things are going, if you, if you have the opportunity to move, you do that. Mm-hmm. You know, like, but most people don't move. No. Most people don't move. They scared to leave. Yeah. They scared to go out of the country because, like I said, we hear about like you can't drink the water over here. Right. You can't eat the food right. over here. You don't want to get with the people because the they eat people. Are like, real. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then you come over here and you be like, damn, there's a lot of white people actually over here. Yeah. I, oh man. I, anyway. <laughs> okay. All right, y'all. So that's it from us. We probably done made some people mad, you know, but hey, that's what you do in life. But yeah, so make sure you like, 
comment, and subscribe, and all three. share. All, well, all four. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we'll see y'all later. All right, y'all. Bye. Bye. Peace and a bottle of hair grease. <laughs>